today's video is really, really exciting. I have a new product to test out. This is the Morphe Prep and Set Makeup Setting Spray. Of course, this is already hyped up to a crazy extent, so I figured I would pick it up and I would see if it's worth it, if it's worth the hype, if I love it, if I hate it, what I think of it, you know what I mean? <laughs> so it did retail for $14.99 on Morphe's website. Of course, if you use a coupon code from anybody on YouTube, you can get $1.49 off. So it ended up being $13.50, but the only really shitty thing about this product is since it's in an aerosol can, it can only be shipped ground, and their ground shipping was $8.62. So this whole thing came out to $22.12, which is kind of like in between the drugstore one, which the L'Oreal one I think is $14 or $16, and then the, what, the Urban Decay one is like $30. So I feel like it's kind of in between, but it just sucks that, I mean, shipping is $5 less than the actual product was, but... You know, it is what it is. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of get into everything it says. So it says prep and set goes the distance without retouching. This lightweight and breathable mist locks in liquid and powder makeup. So go ahead and set it. Directions. Hold the bottle 8 to 10 inches away from face. Close eyes and mist over makeup. Warning. Side effects of this product will cause you to really feel yourself. <laughs> Okay, that's pretty funny. First ingredients are water, glycerin, and I can't say that. But it says there's papaya extract in here, fruit water, and all this other stuff I can't say. <laughs> that's pretty cool though. So the first two products, I mean, are water and glycerin, which is actually really, really nice. Glycerin obviously helps make up stick to your skin a little bit longer, so I'm hoping that this works. The only thing I am so, so excited about is the fact that, I mean, the packaging isn't the cutest. It is really sleek and nice and everything. It just looks like, you know, a hairspray bottle. But the really cool and different thing about this spray is where you can see it. It's like an actual, like, mist. It's not a spray, you know, like this one where you actually have to, like, you know. I do actually really like this L'Oreal Infallible one. It doesn't leave, like, big dots all over my face. But I just love the fact that you can just continuously spray this one, and it's like the most fine mist ever. So cool. And it does smell pretty good, too. I think it just smells fresh. I've heard some people say it smells, they think it smells like coconut or cucumber or anything. I just, I don't know. I feel like it just smells kind of fresh. I don't smell cucumber or um, coconut. <laughs> But I do feel like it smells pretty dang good. So it is a prep and set. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of mist this on my face and see what I think of it. Like how it feels. Nervous. Do you have to shake it? It didn't say to shake it. No, it didn't say to shake it. Okay. Mm, nervous. And you can definitely tell I just sprayed something on my face. It was so like lightweight like I don't feel like anything was actually sitting on my face but it does feel a little tacky <laughs> cool okay it doesn't feel sticky it just feels a little tacky it doesn't feel greasy it doesn't feel gross so I am so excited to see how makeup applies and everything I'm gonna go ahead and do another tutorial and I will be right back and we can set our face and kind of do like final thoughts Alright guys, so I did a tutorial on this look right here, so make sure you keep a lookout for that. But I am going to go ahead and set my face with the Morphe Prep and Set. I am so excited. I am going to be doing like kind of like a wear test or a check-in when I get home from work later. I want to see if it helped with like the longevity of my makeup because I know how this one works and I pretty much did my same base that I always do. So I'm going to have a good idea of how I like it, if it breaks up my makeup, if it irritates my skin or anything. So let's do this. I will say, you don't feel like you're putting on that much product, but now feeling it like with my hair down, I definitely just put on a lot. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to be going through this so quick. It's such a fine mist that it just, like it feels so lightweight and amazing. And honestly, it feels really nice. It doesn't feel... It, uh, hmm. What's crazy is it doesn't feel like tacky like when I first put it on. Maybe it's just like because it's adhering to the powder or something. I don't know. I mean, it doesn't make you like dewy or extra matte or anything. 
I absolutely love the spray on this. It is so just clean and such a fine mist. I, I mean, you'll never have like one of those weird huge blobs on your face that some of the other setting sprays can do. It's just, I like it a lot so far, I'm not going to lie. But I'm going to go ahead and kind of wear it throughout the day and I'll come back in and I'll check in with you and let you know what I think of the new Morphe setting spray.